What's up guys, GT Gamer here and welcome back to OCRP and we are currently 10-7 for approximately one month maybe because Nick Purton, Officer Nick Purton has handed in his badge temporarily of course but for the time being we are now Civ permanently, well permanently for the time being as in there's no more cops for the next month at least a month because that's kind of the rules you have to be a minimum of a month before switching back but yeah, we are, um... Come on, you're gonna go? Oh, God damn it, you son of a bitch. We are gonna be civilian, and that also entails the fact that we can do criminal. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. I think that's awesome. So, uh, a few things we need to do. Move, you bitch. Fuck it. Park in here. I need to go hand in my gun and my um, badge. Just need to go hand everything in. Um, better not be stopping my car. No, probably not. But yeah, we can't hear the police radio anymore. The police scanner. Nope, that's gone. Uh, how the f how do you drop weapons? I think you got to go. Uh, pistol and keep in because we have actually bought a pistol in um, in RP. So I'm going to remove that and. Uh, I'm going to remove my... Ooh, I'm going to remove the pistol and keep the combat pistol, actually. Pistol's gone. I love the way they just pile up on the desk. That is perfect, because that's where we would actually put them in real life. Oh, we've got some weed on us. Shit. That's perfect. Uh, combat carbine rifle, even. My brain just exploded then. Pump shotgun. Yep, we'll remove that. We got the weed. That was that's brilliant. That was we confiscated that off a um, off a sieve, and it's in our inventory. So no, I didn't want to give it. Yeah, I know. I threw a fire extinguisher. I don't need it. Ah, uh, do I give the weed to the cops or do I try and sell it? Oh, <laughs> unlucky buddy. Okay. Well, I wasn't quite sure what we was gonna do today, but I guess. We're recording this. Oh my god, man. Going to be like the the annoying guy who records everything. Oh my god, this truck. Yeah, this totally big, massive truck. Flying on you. He was going 110 miles an hour. I saw it with my own eyes. I saw it. He was 110. Slammed into this innocent guy. I'm just kidding. I don't know what happened. He, despite the fact I was right behind him. There's some shiny-ass keys on their belt. They're actually really detailed. That's GTA, man. Gotta love it. Right, that's enough fucking eavesdropping. Don't need to do that anymore. I am, though, going to be Instagram famous, hashtag, and take a selfie. Oh, yeah, let me take a selfie. Uh, I'm not quite in the right place. I need to go more over sort of here, maybe. No. No. Come on, show me this camera. Yeah. No. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that is how I want it. Boom, selfie, snaps, puts it on Instagram, etc, etc. I don't know, I don't do that shit. I don't even like Snapchat that much, to be honest. The only time I go on is to talk to some girl I'm talking to. That's pretty much it. And off we go. Bye. So yeah, we can actually break the law now, which is excellent. Not going to say every single episode for the next month is going to be me breaking the law, but... Actually, that's not true. It probably will be. I don't know. I might do Fisherman or something for a bit. But for the time being, as I said, I don't exactly know what we're going to do. I might try and sell some drugs. Would anyone like to buy any weed? Huh. Only issue now is I don't know where any sieves are. Um. You know what? Uh, no, I probably shouldn't put it on Twitter. Mm hmm. How would you sell drugs without driving around? Because if I put it on Twitter, the police are allowed to use Twitter as a resource. So if I, it'll come up with my name saying, anyone want to buy drugs? And then they'll just know it's me. So that wouldn't work. I don't think there is any way to do it in text chat. Oh well, let's just drive around until we find some saves. I need to sell all of it before. How much have we got? Because I need to sell all of it before we actually get arrested. So we've got. Nothing bad on us except two small bags of weed, 
and 49 bags of weed. Um, issue is, I can't remember if it's the big bags or the small bags which make you go crazy. Oh, no, it's the big bags. <laughs> yeah, we're now high as a kite. Oh yeah, this is going to be fun. Oh, this is trippy. Oh my god. Dude, the lines and the roads are like waving. And I, I have no depth perception. I can't tell where anyone is. <laughs> okay, it's the big bags that get you stoned. We found that out. We've established that much. Oh my god. Okay, I really need to keep an eye out on our speed because I can't tell what cars are cop cars. Um... Oh my god, I'm at, I'm trying to keep it straight now. It's it's a lot harder than it looks, believe me. Lost for uh, there's two rev limiters. <laughs> I don't like this. Oh my god, it actually feels like I'm high right now. I mean, I have no idea what it feels like to be high. Uh, we've got petrol. Okay, I'm just gonna drive around and look for sieves. They don't call these things sports cars for nothing. Oh yeah. Overtake. 100, nearly 100. Come on, hit 100, hit 100. This is technically a blind corner. And I'm stoned. You see, this is why my insurance is three and a half grand. Oh, God. No, can't see. Okay, there, there, got it. See, ingenuity, that's what you need. Fuck it, let's go this way. Undertake. Oh, my God, it's bouncing. I am spaced out right now. The car was bouncing on the potholes and shit in the gravel and it was really hard to control. <laughs> this is... What I'm thinking, I really... The, the more time I spend selling weed driving like this, the more likely it is I'm going to get caught with weed driving like this. So, I'm thinking if I do like a deal, like I will give you all the weed I've got for 25,000 bucks. I think they'll take it. I might even go for 50. Yeah, I'm going to go for 50 and bartle them down. Oh, I need to find some sieves first, though. It's getting dark. This is really trippy. Like, I can't even tell where the junction was then. Oh, God, it's even trippier when you turn in. Okay. That's not good. Oh, my God, they're still here, really? I am not waiting in traffic. You can suck my big toe. Uh, I'm going to go this way. Screw it. Why not? Okay. I'm walking like I'm stoned. The cops see me now, I'm done for it. <laughs> ah well, I wanna go to the bank. ATM, come on, don't get your gun out, you piece of shit. Why is my mouse appearing? Um Ah, there you go. That took a while to respond then, what the fuck? Um I wanted to pause it Ooh, thirty thousand. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. Perfect. Okay. We got away with that. Wheel spin. Oh my god, that effect is getting worse. It looks like cars are driving into each other, then merging into one. It's fuck. Watch the headlights on this car. There's two of them, there's two of them. Now there's one of them. What? How? That doesn't happen. I mean, I wonder if that happens when you're high. I don't do drugs. Don't do drugs, kids. Um, I'm actually spinning out right now. <laughs> I've been staring at my um, through my eyes so long at my monitor. You know what I mean? That is there. I don't like this. <laughs> oh my god! You guys get to see like an edited version, so it's fine. But this has been going on for ten minutes now, and I haven't seen a single person or cop other than the dudes on Joshua, on Alhambra, whatever that road is. I really don't like this. Come on, effect, just go. Oh, there's no one down here, surely turn around. Yes, it finally wore off. Thank God, that was spinning me the fuck out. I just blew a stop sign. It's fine. Right, now I can actually see where I'm going. Duh. I'm going to uh, look out for some sieves. I really want to find someone and sell some weed too, you crazy motherfucker. See, that's what you get when you look at your second, um, second okay. monitor. That's just getting ridiculous now. Ooh. Um. Is there anyone in that car over there? That police car? 
I want to sell drugs to this dude. Uh, um, how do I do this without... Oh. My eyes just froze. Ah, what are you doing? Hey man, want to uh, wanna buy some weed? What's up? Wanna buy some weed? No, God. No, I don't want to buy, 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 buy. Whoa. Beep, beep. Shit. Why is everything freezing? Beep, 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 beep. Uh, why is my game doing this to me? And why did he snitch me out like that, motherfucker? Why is my game freezing? That's not good. Nothing's good. If he snitches on me now, I swear to God, he's going on my hit list. Oh, okay. Why you do this game? Okay, I'm getting. I'm getting. I'm getting out of here. Whoa, drift. Um, okay, I'm going... Shit, where can I go? I need to get out of here. I know he's snitching on me. <laughs> Fucking Yvette and Obby, I swear to God. Ah, uh, you know what? I need to get home. Okay, four wheel drive. Screw it. <laughs> it's four wheel drive. Eek. God, that was close. I just need to get out of the area and then I'm gonna go home and store my weed. Because I know he's gonna snitch on me. And all I want was a quick 50,000 bucks. It's not that hard, jeez. Okay guys, I um, just deposited all my weapons, my weed, well not my weapons, my weed. And um, that's all sorted, so I'm going back up to the county, I want to see how they react to this. Um, it still works, it's fine. Watch now, I'll hit something really minor and the engine will die. Guaranteed. 100% guaranteed. Right, I want to get to the county as fast as I can. So, the next shot's either going to be us at the repair station or us getting pulled over. One or the other. The important thing is, you'll know. Fixed it. Boom ting. That's how you do it. Right. Let's see if our vehicle is actually bolo'd. What are rally cars for, eh? Exactly that. Well, not really. You're also not supposed to be doing 94 miles an hour. Ooh. What the f... AI. Oh, did he want something then? Oh, nice car, man. How you doing? I'm, I'm good. Uh, I'm Donnie. I'm Donnie with uh, Donnie's Refuse Service. Uh, I help take care of people's pests. I uh, didn't know if you needed any help with anything. Do I look like I'm covered in pests? Damn cockroaches and shit? Motherfucker. Uh, well, your house could be. Damn, you don't drive a car like this if you have a shitty house. Motherfucker. Ah, uh, yeah, but, you know, roaches don't judge. That's what they tell me. No, but if they enter my house, they get shot. <laughs> Shooting cockroaches. Oh, okay, alright. I like that. Yeah, so do I. It's a good game. Well, you know. Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, you know, I'm sorry again for, uh, you know, uh, approaching you, but, you know, gotta get the word out there somehow. It's fine, fool. Okay. Contact right. you if I see any cocks in my house. <laughs> oh, yeah, do that. I love cocks. Oh, my God. There it is. There it is. 468 has also apparently become a sieve. Uh, don't need headlights. Uh, I need to keep my eyes on the road, though. Damn, these cars are fuel thirsty. Holy shit. Of course, the advantage about being an ex-cop is you know exactly all the, exactly where all the police hang out and you know all their tactics when they chase you. Uh, I really should not use that to my advantage, but I might. Uh, yeah, yeah, pretty much might. Like I, for example, well, most people do actually, but I know where how to tell when the police are moving in for a pit. And I know what types of roads they choose for spikes and... All that shit. Is there anyone in that car? Damn it, I was gonna have a new HP car then. Shit, there it is. Uh, I'm getting on the highway. Screw it. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, 
You know what? I'm going to be the most awkward prick ever. I'm going to stop here. Boom, yeah. How'd you like that? What the fuck, man? Bitch hit my car. Okay, he says he didn't hit my car. I believe him. But motherfucker better not try that shit again. Oh well, he, um, he got me. Not even gonna try and uh, hide it, he got me. But I am wanted for drugs. Haha, <laughs> how's he gonna handle this one? How am I gonna handle this one? How's anyone gonna handle this one? That guy was speeding. I need to stop jumping from one accent to another. I need to decide an accent for this character right now. Um, hey man. <laughs> no, not at all. Good day, sir. It's uh, uh, Deputy Jones with the San Andreas, or er, correction, the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Do you have your license registration and proof of insurance on you? What'd you stop me for, man? Uh, you were driving a little recklessly up there, uh, dodging in and out of traffic, passing that vehicle on the right. I don't remember that. <laughs> I totally did that. I have my dash cam going, sir, so... Well, my name should be on the plate. You should run that first. Okay. Do you have your uh, your license on you? Yeah, I do. All right. You mind giving that to me? Here you go. How'd you swear All right, at the window? Can you confirm the name here. Yeah, man. It's Nick. They call Nick me the Big what? N. Perton. They call you the Big N. Yeah, man. Sorry, what was the last name? Purton. P U R T O N. Oh my god, look at all this backup. Okay, just uh, sit tight with me for a second, alright? One car, two car, here comes a third, guaranteed. What are they talking about back there? Are they talking about my paranoia? They better not be. I'm not paranoid. They better not be, be talking about my paranoia. Nah, <laughs> just kidding. Nah, they're totally mentioning the fact I'm wanted for drugs. If that doesn't get mentioned, then shoot me in the head. Because I'm pretty sure they told him. But I got the perfect excuse. Ha 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 ha. What the fuck did that Porsche just do? That's not normal. You should get your suspension checked out. That's bad. Hey, Mr. Purton. What's up? Oh, not much. My name's uh, Trooper Edwards of San Andreas Highway Patrol. Um, do you care to just step out of the car for us and come back here and talk to us for a few minutes? Why? We just want to talk to you out here, sir. You can talk to me here. The window's open. The fresh air's rolling. What do you want? Uh, we have some things that we need to talk to you outside of the car. Such as? You would find that out as soon as you step out of the car. I'd prefer to find out here. That's not the way this works. Uh, I'm writing the rules, and this is the way I want it to work. Sir, you're being detained on a traffic stop, so... For what reason? You gotta abide by our rule. On that what? will be told to you here, he said, that deputy back there, when I pulled up, told me that you, he saw you, I believe up on uh, 68, passing on the right, which is not allowed, so that's the reason for the traffic stop. I didn't ask about the traffic stop, I asked why I'm being detained. You're being detained on a traffic stop. When you're on a traffic stop, you're detained. It's that simple. Okay, there's no reason for me to get out of the car, though. There is a reason I want to talk to you outside the vehicle, and if you fail to do that, then you're a failure to comply to the law, law enforcement officer. I have the right to sit in my vehicle, and unless you give me good reason as to why I should step out, I am going to continue to sit in my vehicle. Is that sweat dripping down your forehead, deputy? Oh, well, Trooper. We'll see you about that here in a few minutes. Yeah, that's what I thought. Waddle away, bitch. <laughs> He's not stepping out. I'm not gonna run unless they force me to. If they force me to run, I'm gonna throw them off their game. Yeah, it's uh. Ooh. Hold on, what's the play to that say? Baller? Oh, yeah, I'm a baller. 
with mild damage to the back because of him I crashing into me. Three instead of an E. And an eight instead of a B. You know, should have bought your glasses with you. But yeah, if I have to I'm run, go I'm not going to go the, forward. Uh, I'm going to pull forward to the right and then floor it in reverse. Weed earlier. Hey, dickhead! <laughs> hey, your friend's not looking so good. <laughs> yeah, we'll see about that. I just got a quick question to ask you. Um, we had an individual come to us earlier and describe your vehicle to a T, saying that you were trying to sell them weed. So, what's the deal with that? Oh, uh, really? You see that uh, a blue car right by there? Well, um, he's driving a blue car and he just murdered someone. See? I said he just murdered someone. Doesn't mean it's true. So, why does someone saying I'm selling weed make that true? What's your answer to that it's one, big boy? It's a simple question. Well, That's I ain't selling no weed. I don't do that shit. Just cocaine for me. <laughs> no, so you do cocaine instead. No, it's being sarcastic. <laughs> yeah, I'm not in the game of being sarcastic. Especially when it comes to drugs. Fortunately, I am, so get used to it. This guy must hate me right now. Alright, well, we'll see about that. Nice hat. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I don't want to alarm you, but there's a dead guy in the road behind you. Mm. Smells a little bit of weed. Alright, sir, you mind just uh, stepping out of the vehicle here so we can have a chat? Why? Because we'd like you to step out of the vehicle so we can have a chat back here, please. This is bullshit. So, can you explain why I've got the odor of marijuana coming from your vehicle? I smoke it sometimes, so what? It's legal. It's not totally not legal. Legal to a point. But either way, me smelling the odor of marijuana gives me probable cause to, to search your vehicle. So before I do so, is there anything in that car that I need to be aware about? Yeah, the gear stick's a little bit pointy so you might hurt your hand on it. <laughs> I'm not going to be taking it anywhere. Alright. While he d is searching that, is there anything on you? I'm just going to pat you down, make sure that we're all safe here. Just my, uh, got two bags of weed on me. Medical purposes. That's fine. As long as it's two bags, as long as it's under five, you're completely fine. So just go ahead and turn around and face that vehicle real fast. So I'll just pat you down and then we'll get you on out of here. Oh, and I got a bottle of whiskey on me and some beers, but they're um, they're still in the packaging, not opened. That's all good. You're fine. All right, so I didn't find anything in the vehicle at all. Okay, he's just got two um, bags of weed on him, but it's under five, so he's perfectly fine. Okay. So, sir, um. We've had reports that you've been trying to sell marijuana to people. Then that guy needs to be arrested for false police reports, you get me? My accent keeps changing. It, it wasn't a, a police report issued, it was just a complaint of it. Well, motherfuckers bullshitting, you get me? You search me, I got well, nothing on me. Why yeah, you just have little two bags of weed on you and that was it. Yeah, medical, but I got bad eyeballs. Reason why <laughs> that's fine, I'm not saying that it was illegal, I'm just was stating a fact. But um, the reason why we're treating it like this is because we have an individual that said you came up to them, they described your car and what you're wearing, and then said that you proceeded to ask them if, you, if they wanted to buy weed off of you. So... We're going to treat that as if it's a valid valid complaint until we've been proven otherwise, okay? You have now been proven otherwise, so am I free to go? Okay, but the issue is, sir, uh, it hasn't been proven because you do have marijuana on you. So that does kind of confirm to us in a sense that you may have approached this person and offered them marijuana. Why would I do if, that? If you had nothing on you, if you had nothing on you, then yeah, we could be like, okay, well, 
he, he may not have because he doesn't have anything on him. But when you do, it kind of shows us differently. Whether I do or whether I don't is regardless. I have a legal amount and there's no way to prove or disprove I said anything to whoever the hell you're talking about. So am I free to go? Uh, not at this time, sir, because I'm going to be writing you up for careless driving uh, up there on 68. That's bullshit. It's just casually a dead guy chilling in the road backwards. Dan 22, my bad. <laughs> oh well. It's a good reason to punch a cop. Now I can't get out of this fight mode. Alright, sir. So. I'm going to be citing you for careless driving. Uh, it'll be a $2,000 fine. If you don't mind signing at the bottom here, it's not an admission to guild, it's just a promise that you'll take care of this. Whatever. Yeah, you go, man. Am I free to go, fam? I need to go Mackey D's here. to get me. Can I give you your copy? Oh, I received right, an invoice. Sir, you can pay that by uh, email transfer. Yeah, I know, fam. I don't know how to do it. Um, uh, I think I know why. Yeah, I'm jobbed up as a cop. Shit. Okay, I need to fix that one. Alright, sir, so you can go uh, sit in your car, and then uh, once we turn off our lights, you're free to go, alright? Whatever. Damn, motherfucker's hungry. Can you close all my shit for me once you're done? Jesus. Um, doors. There. Uh, Alright. Right rear door, hood, trunk. Oh, could have just done that. Bye. Okay, my jeez. You get me. I've settled on an accent. It is going to be South London Chav. You get me, fam? It's basically like Ghetto, but our version. It's not... I mean, it's a shit accent, but meh, whatever. Um, let me know if this accent annoyed you by giving me a thumbs up. And let me know if this accent didn't annoy you by giving me a thumbs up. I sounded retarded then. Um, one last thing we have to do, we got to find the pay. I've never actually done this before. I just got fined. Okay. Right, whatever. Anyway, guys, I'm going home. Um, let me know if you thought this video, whether you'd like to see more Civ or more LEO. I mean... It doesn't actually matter that much because I can't switch back for at least a month so sorry but if you do like Civ then let me know give me some suggestions for scenarios I'd love to hear them and as always thanks for watching peace out guys